Thank you, Lexi. New this morning, a group advocating for the legalization of adult recreational marijuana use submitted thousands of signatures to the Secretary of State's office. And according to NBC's Andrew Rapperson, a lawyer for the group in Arkansas said he thinks an amendment will be on the ballot in November. Offloading hundreds of boxes. 1110. Signing the required documents to get a recreational marijuana use amendment on the ballot. We're, again, confident in our signatures and confident in our amendment. Steve Lancaster represents Responsible Growth Arkansas, an advocacy group for legalized pot. Only 89,000 valid signatures are required. They're checked, and then the State Board of Election Commissioners decides whether it makes the ballot. We've got uh, a proposal that we believe a majority of our Kansans can get behind. The amendment would limit sales only to adults 21 and older while limiting the number of licenses to 20 cultivators and 120 dispensaries in Arkansas. No at-home growing would be allowed. What we're proposing is, is not uh, really out in left field. Other advocacy groups say RGA is trying to monopolize the industry. Theirs is horrible. Melissa Fultz is a part of Arkansas Normal, which is gathering signatures for a 2024 amendment. She says the people behind RGA's amendment are only interested in one type of green. We need the competition and we need everyday people in it, not the mega rich. I wouldn't be surprised if, if there were some organizations that uh, would be opposed to this and we'll, we'll address that. Lancaster says he doesn't think any challenges will be enough to keep the amendment off the ballot. I think come November uh, we'll pass this thing.